Where are all the aliens? In all of this massive universe, there is literally an astronomically high chance that there is at least one other planet with intelligent life on it. So where's the proof? They must be trying to contact us as much as we're trying to contact them. If there's really any life out there, then why haven't we heard anything from them? There's actually two big reasons that could explain why other intelligent life forms haven't reached out to us yet. First, intelligent life takes a long time to develop, and second, other intelligent life forms could just be too far away. I think we take for granted how long it took for the universe to become habitable for humans. There was a lot of setup that needed to happen before we could even become a possibility. I think a good way to demonstrate this is with my new favorite unit, Galactic Years. One galactic year is the amount of time it takes for our solar system to orbit once around the Milky Way galaxy, approximately 225 million Earth years. The universe itself is about 61.2 galactic years old. After the creation of the universe, it took a little over one galactic year for the Milky Way to form. After the Milky Way, it took 39.6 galactic years for our sun to form. And a little fun fact, our sun is now 20.4 galactic years old, almost old enough to galactically drink. After our sun formed, it took a quarter of a galactic year for the Earth to form, 3.25 galactic years after that for the oceans to form, and an additional 0.3 galactic years for the first life to show up in the ocean. But then things slowed down. A lot. It took 10 whole galactic years from the time the first life showed up on Earth to the first multicellular organism. Multicelled organisms have only existed on Earth for the last 7 galactic years. Life on Earth has been single-celled for over half of its existence. That's insane. And after all that setup and preparation, the first humans showed up just 0.03 galactic years ago. All that time to make just a tiny livable space that intelligent life can be possible on. And we literally just got here. If we compared galactic years to Earth years, that would make humans just 11 days old. The truth is, it just takes a while for intelligent life to happen. It took 61.2 galactic years of setting up the perfect galaxy, sun, and planet for humans to exist. It's impossible to tell since we only have a single data point, but there's a theory that this is the normal time it takes for intelligent life to form because of all these requirements for life and how long it takes to set them up. And if that's the case, that would mean that intelligent life is completely new to the universe. The oldest civilizations in the universe may only be a few galactic years older than us, or there's a teeny tiny chance that we're the first. We don't know. If this theory turned out to be true, that would mean the universe may have just recently entered a new era, the era of intelligent life. And we are a part of this new era. Whew, I just got chills. And this brings us to the main issue. Life might be too new and too far away for us to make contact right now. If all the intelligent life forms in the universe have all formed around the same time, then there's a good chance that we're all trying to contact each other at the same time as well, sending out radio signals and hoping for a response. The problem here is that things in the universe are extremely spread out, and radio waves can only move so fast. Radio waves travel at the speed of light, the fastest anything could physically travel, but even then, it would take an incredibly long time for signals to reach any potentially intelligent life. If the closest intelligent life to us is in the Milky Way galaxy, then it could take up to 100,000 years for our radio signals to reach them, meaning that if nothing goes wrong, it may take 200,000 years for just two intelligent species in the same galaxy to say hello to each other. The first radio signal was sent and received on Earth less than 150 years ago we would have to wait well over a thousand times that long to get a response from another intelligent civilization in the same galaxy. Or maybe we're completely alone in our galaxy, but we have neighbors in the next closest galaxy, Andromeda, which is two and a half million light years away. If you sent a radio message to someone in Andromeda, you would be waiting five million years before the chance of you even getting a response. And if it turns out there is no life in Andromeda, and if the next closest intelligent life is further away, in any of the billions upon billions of galaxies in the universe, then we'll need to wait even longer, maybe even galactic years, before we get that first blip that shows we're not alone in the universe. If intelligent life has existed in the universe for dozens of galactic years already, then there's a chance that their radio signals might reach us very soon since it's taken those signals dozens of galactic years to reach us. But if all intelligent life in the universe truly formed around the same time, then that means we're starting a long journey, waiting for those faraway signals to reach us. And all we can do is wait, listen, and see what we find. And with that, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Goodbye!